What is going on everybody? EJ Webbs here back with another video and today I'm going to open up two Pokemon treasure chests. We have this first one which came out last year which I previously opened on the channel and then we have this one that just came out about a month ago featuring Scarlet and Violet sets. So I got this one from a bundle from Costco that was $19.99 came with a pencil case that came with two packs as well. So this plus the pencil case almost $40 in retail got it for $20 so I don't know, might have to go back to Costco to get um, more of those sets. And then we do have this brand new one, which I got from Target today for $30. So let's see which one has the better pulls. I am going to start with this one. No Obsidian Flames in this opening, I believe. So I'm gonna throw it back. Something a little bit different. And we get some Scarlet and Violet though. Alright, open up the chest, and on top here we got the Yasuian Voltorb, the Yasuian Growlithe, and the Sneasel cards. There's the coin, I like that one, it's purple, and it is of orange and form Palkia. Do have a good amount of those cards, or uh, coins. So here's like a better look at those cards. We do have the Hisuian Voltorb. This is, that is from, I believe, Astral Radiance, Hisuian Sneasel, and Hisuian Growlithe. Those aren't actual uh, promo cards. They're just uh, reprint. So they're Galactic Hall Foil cards from the Astral Radiance set. We do have this code card right there. So much waste in these Pokemon card openings. Just hate all the recycling that goes into it. All right. That's everything. We do have the binder. I don't really use these binders. Uh, might just donate them when I have a chance. So we have sticker sheets. I like to keep these not in use. I think they're pretty cool just to have on their own. And we do have the notebook too. Not talking about the movie, just talking about this notebook. So not too much going on, just pretty basic stuff when it comes to these collector's chests. I don't really keep the collector's chests. I just uh, donate them. So we do have two Silver Tempest, uh, an ast two Astral Radiance, and a Fusion Strike because the box actually showed um, Lost Origin. But I'll take Silver Tempest instead of Lost Origin anyways. Astral Radiance, let me... Oh, uh, let me do it like that. Let's see if we could get something good out of that ass. Troll Radiance. So we have a Energy, Yuxi, Vesuian Overquill, Kamado, Petalil, Nicket. Hippopotas, Cyndaquil, Hisuian Growlithe, a Dartrix Reverse, and a Rampardos Hollow. So starting off with a Hollow. See what this other Astro Radiance pack has. Of course, it's not like now where Hollows are guaranteed in the Scarlet and Violet series of sets, but. I guess it's a little bit more special pulling a hollow back then. We have a Hisuian Heavy Ball, Hippowdon, Dark Patch, Scyther, Hisuian Growlithe, Mantine, Ponyta, Krikatot, Mayana Reverse, and a Cleavor Non Hollow. So, Fusion Strike. I think this is the largest set of Pokemon ever made. We have a Energy Diggersby, Sydney Prescott. We have a Cross Switcher, Phalanx, Morpeko, Smeargle, Quillfish, Tynamo, Meltan Reverse, and a Latias. 
regular rare. Two Silver Tempest to end it off. I had to get a hit out of uh, this box. I definitely wanted to be out of Silver Tempest. Of course, there's Trainer Gallery cards, Radiant cards. Of a energy, regenerative energy, and identified fossil, V Guard, Clink, Stunfisk, Togedemaru, Esper, Smeargle, Duosion, and an Incineroar regular rare. So, last pack out of this box. I think I might have saw something good. Let's see what we got. We have an Energy, Serena, Regenerative Energy, Duosion, Dreepy, Creepy Dreepy, Vulpix, Amolga, Chimeco. We have a Buneri. The reverse is a Candice, and ooh, it's a full art. Is this an alternate art? Oh, no, but it's a Lugia full art. That is an awesome card. Lugia, I love the colors on that. Lugia V, full art. Saving the best pack for last for that box, that chest. Ooh, I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to this Zoom. But this, this I have not opened before. Um, I don't know if I will open it because, yeah, the seal is pretty tight. Um, there we go. is put that to the side let's open and let's see what we get we have this coin um don't know what pokemon that is through the camera um oh it's maridon it's kind of hard really dark to see on the that here is code card for the online game and we have the promo cards. We have a Fuecoco, Quaxly, and a Sprigatito. Those are just from Paldea Evolved. So just holo, holo cards from Paldea Evolved. Next little layer here are the packs that are on the ground now. Oh. And then the sticker sheets. So we have Maridon and Coridon. We have the starters. We have a little bit of both. And the other starters. And then the mini binder. So no notepad in this one. I guess they ditched the notepad. They also just ditched the pencils too. Like, come on. Like, what are we doing here? And you know, don't you want uh, kids to buy this? school a pokemon lunchbox come on throw the pencils in throw the notebook in well i guess everything's digital now anyways but <laughs> there'll be a two silver tempest two paldea evolved and two scarlet and violet and rumor has it that the silver tempest packs in these collector's chests are absolutely cracked out with hits so i'm actually gonna save those for last see if that's true i'll go oldest to newest so paldea evolved into scarlet into um, Silver Tempest. So starting off with this Skeledurge pack of Caldea Evolved. First uh, Scarlet and Violet era packs in this opening. Still have a booster box of Caldea Evolved. Uh, not open. I don't really know what to do with it. Magikarp, Slowpoke, Litleo, Giacomo, Talonflame, Heracross, the first reverse the Krogunk, the second reverse is a Sneasel, and the rare is a Paldean Clodsire EX. That is a new hit to the collection, Paldean Clodsire. Pretty cool with those hits. Put that up there. So, at least we're not shut out in this, these, that, the second chest at least. Oops. 
Not the Cloud Sire. You stay there, Cloud Sire. Redeem that code card. Nice to go back and open up some Paldea Evolved after opening up so much Obsidian Flames of the Riesland. Then the Elite Trainer Box, the Booster Box, did a 14-pack opening. Um, yeah, I did a lot of stuff. So we have a Nacoli. Oh my god, a Chien Pao EX Secret Rare. Oh my god, we have anything fastest? Nope, it's just a Tyranitar Hollow, but oh my goodness, a Chien Pao EX Gold card, number 274 of 193. This is insane. Getting gold. So two packs in, Paldea Evolved. Literally, are you sure the, the Silver Tempest are the ones with the good cards? Like, I'm pretty sure it's Paldea Evolved, but with this tent at least, maybe, maybe they got a newer um, distribution run of those these tins and said, we're actually gonna put the hits inside of Paldea Evolved instead of Silver Tempest. But if we're gonna get some good cards in Silver Tempest, I will take that too, because that just means more cards, juicy cards. This is Scarlet and Violet right here. Tandem Mouse, Poke Gear 3.0, Floet, Textricity, Mouse Hold, of a Crocolore, Tandem Mouse, the, is a Poke Gear 3.0, and just a hollow, a slow bro holographic. So the second Scarlet and Violet base set. So the color of the codes I don't think should matter at all. So we have a basic energy, the chunk, catching a lot of little chunks in Pokemon Go. Zangus, Floragato, XP Share, Squawkabilly, the second reverse is a Tandem Mouse and a Meowth Scarta Holographic. So Sword and Shield, Silver Tempest is our final two packs. And we could do the little test to see if we do get some creamy pulls out of this set. Are all the rumors true about getting really good hits in these packs? Let's say we have Professor Laventon, Dracloak, a Heldum, Stunfisk, a Snorunt, a Vulpix, a Fletchling, a Noibat Reverse, and a Delphox. Non hollow rare. The last pack in this opening, Silver Tempest. Watch out because after this, I do have a very big opening. I think that's gonna be the second one released after this opening is live. I do have very big plans. Very big, uh, really cool, but kind of expensive video coming up. Leafy Camo Poncho, Slurpuff, Dupiter, Ponyta, Ralts, Venonat, a Spinda, the reverse is another Spinda, and a Milotic non hollow. So, overall, very good pulls. Let me just show you each card that I got. So, three hits in this opening out of 11 packs. Plus, if you do include that hollow I got from, uh, was it? Astral Radiance, I and mean, that's not a guaranteed hollow, but we did get the Paldean Cloud Sire EX, the Lugia V Beautiful Full Art, and the best pull of the opening is a Chien Pao EX Gold card. So there you guys go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more awesome and epic videos coming soon. Remember, Pokemon 51 151 is right around the corner, so when that set comes out, you know I'm going to be opening up some packs of that. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.